to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. I don't know, Lee. Seems like a long shot. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh -uh. Get away. I just need to... I told you to get the fuck away! Sorry. Don't talk to me, Lee. Don't fucking talk to me. You've got to pull yourself together, Lily. Why? For your sake? So you can feel better about... about what you did? For your own sake. Right. Because you fucking care so much about me. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something... No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. In other words, my father's more useful to you dead than alive. If he was alive and had the key to getting us out of here, do you think he'd keep it to himself? What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your... Permission. Do what you have to do. Oh, boy. Uh, any idea which pocket he keeps his change in? You fucking vulture! And a dime. Just gotta remove these screws and get this unit off. You got it? Yeah. One more should do it. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. It's too small for us to fit through. I can do it. I know you're brave enough. I'm scared. Remember the treehouse? You held out for days. And I saved your life. <laughs> That's right. Okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Didn't even get to say goodbye. Get in here. I got an idea. Stay here. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. Damn 
human slaughterhouse. So what's the plan? That dumbass is so caught up in his own rant that we could probably sneak right up on him. Just stick behind me in case anything goes down. When we get to the front, grab his gun. Sounds good. Okay, you ready? Yeah, let's go. Stay close. Hey, what are you doing outside the barn? Oh shit! Just guarding the place, like you said. Man, we're sitting out in the rain like a damn deer. Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. Pick one to keep and kill the rest. And I pick which one to keep alive. Not the kid. Don't let me make the trade. Oh, I know, Mason. This is Take my off favorite the crack too. When I let one think they can just walk right out, <laughs> they never even look down. Lee, focus. Where's Danny? can live. Mark never volunteered to be food! You gotta keep me alive! If you kill me, the meat gets tainted! You can't eat it! You're already tainted! You ain't gonna kill me! Just like you didn't kill Jolene! You don't have what it takes! <laughs> Go. I'll keep Clementine safe.
Charlie! Me? Ow! Shh! Is everyone okay? We heard screams as we were coming up to the house. They attacked us! I knew it! I told you we couldn't trust them! Shit! How many of them are there? Two left! Where? Larry's dead! They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed them to us! Shit! Is everyone else okay? They've still got Duck and Katja in the house, and I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. Alright, we're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. Ben, stick close. And Lee, be careful. Get up! Get up! Uh, 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 u
Shotley! <laughs> you ain't shit! It's over! Fuck you! You didn't dare to bubble get out here! You... You all fucked! <laughs> Not coming. What do you mean? Me? What the fuck do you mean? Don't you dare walk away from me, Lee! Get back here and finish this, Lee! Back here and fight me like a man, Lee! Lee! Hey, Lee. I'd say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended, but, you know. I'm glad you showed up when you did. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people? For food? Yeah, they were. That is sick. God, just... Ugh. Clementine, she doesn't know, right? She's not stupid, Carly. Katya managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Yeah. I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. <sighs> How are you doing? I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. Hon, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? I'm with you, Kenny. We'll do what has to be done. You're damn right. Listen, that RV back at the Motor Inn is just about ready. I've changed my mind. I want you to come with us when we leave. Yeah? Hell yeah. We're a team, man, me and you. By taking out Larry before he turned, you saved all of us in that meat locker. And that saved my family, too. Yeah, I'd say you earned it. Come on, Clementine. Stay close. Lee, did you have to kill those men? I'm sorry you had to see that, but I only did it to protect us. Because they tried to hurt us? Yes. Okay. Hey, Dad. What's that noise? Sounds like a car. Oh, God. Not more strangers. Hello?
figures. Oh, crap. Baby, you gotta see this. There's a shitload of food and supplies back here. This food could save all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. What if it's not? What if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. Who says it's your decision to make? Hey, we don't have time for this shit. Like it or not, we need this food. Now get over here and open the trunk, Lee. It's locked. No shit, I already tried that. But I heard you take the keys from up front. Great. Maybe we'll survive this after all. Duck, why don't you carry this? Okay. Supplies? I'll take it. More food in here. Got a box of food here. I'll carry it. This hoodie looks to be about your size. Why don't you hold on to this? It might get cold. It's not mine. It's yours now. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought they might work in your camcorder. Here, you can have some too. For your walkie-talkie. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? Oh, God. Lee, you're gonna wanna see this. Oh, shit. Yes. 